not be surprised here. And suddenly Milan is going to be the first one to eat the first PA support dagger of the game. And he's like, holy crap, I'm very slow. So yep. that with the that's minus another armor. Kill. And that's another dagger. And ladies and gentlemen, that is four position PA for you. And already Slark has skilled up his essence shift. So while he will skill stats oh trade my. really well. Uh, they actually might also get a kill here. Yep. Oh, oh no mana. God. He just doesn't have mana for five seconds. Yeah, Lil sidesteps the stun here. But and they don't need it. They oh don't my. need a crush. They've got Blightstone, Orb of Venom, Is everybody Phantom ready for this in your pubs now? Holy shit, what just happened? But the somewhat thousands of people watching this. Blade Fury. Oh, oh Lil could have turned that oh. so well, too. Arrow. Is he still going? He's still going. going. Yeah, he's committing it hard. The Orb could connect, and that could be just more than enough. Lil's approach to the mid lane already successful now. The Dagger. Level 2 only, Blaze. Beautiful rune to have when you have Coil, Blaze. <laughs> Oh, oh no, Milan caught at the wrong place at the wrong time. Nice two-man stun, but see you later. Slice on up. Lil gets that grab, and he's looking to build up into those phase boots now. So, yeah. Phase Dezo, semi-carry PA after supporting the whole lane. I mean, the only thing you're lacking is a little bit of disable, but going for a core pick like Puck is perfectly fine for that. It's like, I mean... Uh, Bottom lane, pounce connection onto Pasha here. Pasha will be able to get the stun off. Star Storm, they need a bit more. He gets the one. Oh, Not good enough. Yeah. Mitch gets it in the end. Reaching there. That was their first kill. And look how hard they had to sweat for a bit. Bottom lane. Slark making an approach with the return of the Wisp here. Can they get that very annoying Lil down he without losing their Wisp? They might lose both of them here. Pack will be there, though. And that's it. Oh, man. Lil claims that one. The kill that w the hit that would have killed him it was blur dodge twenty percent. Oh. Solo kills him. And uh, okay, Lil, you play with a bit of fire now. The help has come, and he got himself caught in a narrow alleyway where there was no way to dodge that arrow. Nicely done. Nice response from Mitch. Bottom lane, movement for Solo here. Has to dish off the purge. Now he has no more mana, but the coil is going to be coming in from the low ground there by no one. Flops down the sentry, rushing in for the crush. Milan, be able to juke his way out from this one, does not look like it. He will be going down. That could have been a lot worse. I mean, a coil and a lot of rotations from Virtus Pro only yields them a lion takedown. Here on the Slark. But uh, here comes the dagger, and that means the crush. Good time on the pact, but oh my god, it can't make it away. That's. Man. Up the top. PA and the Slaughter together. Top lane. Ramsey's moving in, but that is a cancel, TP. Oh, man. Okay, Gogi. Even Lil getting involved in that one, too. How nice. The Busy Beaver, 3, 2, and 5 all around. At least one of those is neutral. Yeah, and we'll have to see if it's only early game momentum based or if there's still going to be a potential jump up and over the woods. Not to Grandma's house, but to LeBron to get that whisk kill. BP on the up and up, and not done there. Swift endings here now. Coil popped as the pounce goes out, forces out the stun, forces out the shadow dance. And another blur oh, dodge. No. Blur, and then they turn it around. No. This might be another swift one. This one is all Vernus Pro. Good arrow connection. Might be able to get Lil with the Blade Fury. They should be able to certainly get that finish, and they will. Nice follow up takedown of Solo. Here comes Gogi to play now. And Element's showing that they're not looking to shrug this one off just yet. If they can grab this no one kill. Oh, oh. beautiful. I have that finger. Came from another planet. Back to the, the world. Tier one down there for Virtus Pro. And we scope back towards the mid lane where Elements are attempting their own trade here. But now rotations are coming in. Swift ending looks to go for a swift pick. He will be able to get it. Shadow Demon's going to be taken out, but they lose their line on the back end of it. Lil, ooh, barely back in alive, but will be taken down at the end of the day. Mitch, the next one on retreat here. No one making haste to be able to cut him off from the front. Follow-up comes in, but Mitch is under the Moonlight Shadow. Oh! 99 problems, but a Mitch ain't one. Very nicely done by no one. Orbs right on through and forward, and is able to make connection there for Mitch. Oh, man. Here, it's like, oh, well, we still have to worry about Slardar. He's going to get a crush up in two seconds. Purge for the... Clark, can they get it? They're going to commit the coil for this one. Tether comes in. Not a relocate Tether, though. Needs two more seconds, but eventually he will come out from that disruption and he will pay. That's a Slark taking down a big prizey grab for Virtus Pro. Deep dive. Are they going to commit for it? Nope. They got yet. the blink, so but, they can keep it. Oh, the dagger jumps in. LeBron, who commits also for that, will also pay the price. Lil going to be the piper on that one. And Mitch not looking to get involved. Virtus Pro could gather 
in that area. Oh, they're, they're gonna like get a heck shadow, of no though. one. Yeah, they're gonna get a jump from no one here. Looks like in a possible exchange arrow, they should be able to get the finish back at mid lane. LeBron has made his return, and LeBron has been killed. But hey, with a trade like no one going down, it's certainly fine for elements. And a nice save on Swift Ending, too. Oh, Slider up top is actually taking a lot of damage here, and Lil actually gets Arrow trying to help bail him out. Okay, Coil. Oh! oh my god, Lil, are you serious? Crits up, takes down LeBron, lives and moves back in the trees where he'll continue to participate by dishing out daggers, which lead to crushes. Hiding, though, under Moonlight here, and Shadow Blade. That double C versus Pro, what the slow siege game is, and I imagine it's a lot of those things flying through. Daggers from oh. Lil in the back lines. There's going to be the coil jump in on two. They split it back in apart here, and they let their focus onto Milan. They'll get him. Mitch waits out the coil. Will leap back in away, but they will lose the lion at the end of the day. Now the tier three going to be taken apart. Ramsey's continues to go to work. Lil continues to dish out daggers. Mitch is going to be the next target. He gets crushed. Gogi as well. Gogi oh. goes down. Crit power coming out. And Jug is going to be gone. 50 seconds. No buyback. This could be it. Virtus Pro could close this one out in dominating fashion with the Lil PA and company. Ramsey's not really even needing to flex his AM muscles as they just chew right through the first set of racks. And yeah, at this point, it's so difficult to come back from. They're, it might be even run down inside their own base. Solo. Self-disruption, but it looks like it could be set to go down here. It doesn't stop Vega, or not Vega, but Virtus Pro moving back in. No one will go down. As he gets bursted from the figure, Pasha is going to be forced. Seven reduction on Medallion. Combo that up with the Slaughter's level 11. If you got something absurd. You got paper here. Mid lane, Pasha able to go to work. They quickly take out the Marana and Milan. Wow, they will both go down. And you got uh, 29 negative armor. Yeah. And they just don't stand a chance. Ouch. This is ridiculous here, especially with something, yeah, like the pairing of the Slardar. Ridiculous armor manipulation here by Virtus Pro. Slardar is great for vision uh, to continue to fire those stifling daggers, and of course the negative armor makes it so when they do crit, it takes out so much of their HP. Could be it here. Jump in, insta-kill on LeBron, just like that. Virtus Pro looking to close things home here for the final moments of the final game of the BTS Year 4. Hoping to claim the first place Elements had fought so hard to make it to this point. Take it to a three game stretch, but as they even try to defend here and now, they just die the second they walk on in there. As example, Gogi gonna be taken out. No second life for him. Milan will go down again. Last hope is really swift ending here and he's forced to retreat. He's gonna get quickly surrounded and that will do it. Virtus Pro will be your BTS Europe four champions.